Well hello and welcome to another Daiki. Hope everybody is keeping safe and well. Uh, today we're going to be having a look at a new action cam. This one is from Cam Park. Uh, it's to replace the one I have currently been using. Uh, this one has been okay so far. It's not the best. But I wanted to have an upgrade. So I went across to Camp Park and came across this. So let's have a look at what is inside the box. It's a UHD 4K camera. So inside the box we have a redeem accessory. So they say if you give them a review they will either give you an Amazon voucher a 32 gig card and card reader or some accessories to go with it. I recommend to always uh, fill out a review, even if it's a bad review, they still give you the gift. So then in the box we have the camera and accessories. Let's take a quick look at the accessory pack. And in here we also have the important instruction manual. Let's see what the accessories we get with it. Start off, we have two batteries and we have the standard accessories. Ah, this also comes with a watch so you can take photos or start your filming. Stick it on, it's a nice size, I've got small wrists. Seems to fit okay on there. So, and it seems yep, it's rechargeable, so that's fine. So you have your standard bike clip, your USB charger, and all your standard accessories for everything you need. So that's quite good. Also some straps and your clip ties. The thing you don't see here is a battery charger. You charge the batteries up within the camera itself. And then let's take a look at the camera. So in the compartment of the camera. So as normal it comes within the waterproof case. The good thing about this camera is it's waterproof already. So you can use it without having to have the case. So I go on my bike or I go out on the scooter. In this one, I have a, a clip for it uh, to put it in, but it's not waterproof or splashproof or anything. So when I'm going, I have to put it within its case. So So I have to then put it within its case and the thing about them putting it in the case is it drowns out the sound so that's why I went for the cam pack because it's waterproof already and splash proofing that lot it's fine I won't have to stick it in this when I'm going and let's open up the other one another good thing about it is it's got the screw on the bottom, so that way you can fit it directly to your tripod or to your other mount. So I have other uh, cameras, I have a, a Sony camera, what I, I use when I was uh, touring around India. Uh, again, the Sony is a really good camera, but you're limited to what accessories you've got. With this being an action cam, you can use all the standard GoPro or other uh, other camera uh, accessories with it and they're not that expensive. So this, actually feeling the weight, I'd say it's about two times heavier than, than this, but it feels very very sturdy. It's got a rubber feeling around it, and this is just about plastic, so this, as I say, it feels at least twice as heavy as this. And this one has a battery and this one hasn't got a battery in yet, so it feels nice and sturdy. 
you've got the screen on the front so when you are doing your blogging or your selfies you'll get to see your picture here so again opens up quite easy nice and, and easy I have heard some reports that it's quite stiff I expect it to be stiffer than normal because it is waterproof let's see how the battery goes in standard you've got the little tab here you put a battery in there we are I haven't put a memory card in yet but let's have a go at switching it on to see nice it's telling me no memory card it's a bit blurry because I haven't took the little tabs off always remember to do I always forget to do that nice a nice clear screen on the back it's touch screen as well so you hold the M key on the top to switch between the two uh, to the screens you don't you can't have both screens working at once let's see M for a few seconds and it switches to the back so it's just the M button up here you have your power you have your OK button and you have your M button on the top. So here is, let's turn it off while I'm messing around with it. Here you have your charging unit. Again, a little bit stiff, but you have a, a mini HDMI and you also have your mini USB. A good thing about this is also you can put an external speaker on, an external mic I should say, not an external speaker, an external mic. So I'll be giving that a try. So that's the unboxing for now. What I'm going to do is, the battery says it's half charged, but I'm going to have a go at charging the battery. Set up a, a card, uh, again, the card goes in the bottom here. Let's have a quick look. Seems it's 4K, it is good to use. It's a, a good card, and it, I think it does stay to use a U3. Uh, so let me just have a look in my little box here. U1, U3. Yes. I'm going to put a 64 gig card in. I will do a more in-depth view of going through uh, the, me the menus and that lot once I have a little play with it. But for now, let's just wait in. I've set it. Oh, I, li I like the way you can just, at the back here, you can just flick through to change it to the settings you want. So, again, that's just switching through. I like it. A little beep so let's have a go just recording okay I'll put this clip in as well so you get to see the recording but yes I'll say that's a quick unboxing I will have a go at playing with it myself just once it's all charged up and then I'll do another review okay for now stay safe Take care. Out. Okay. I'll put this clip in as well so you get to see the recording. But yes.